okay, she's showing us where the, what are they, what do they call the, the, the skins? <laughs> the skins are coming out the back there. And then what do they, what do they do with that stuff? Do you know? Uh, uh, make a fertilizer. Fertilizer. Then, or you have a piggery, it's nice that they fall in the ground if you have piggery. Oh, Maybe, yeah. yeah, they align the piggery. Okay. Yeah. All right. It's rice harvesting season here, so we've got Rice Road right here. Okay, honey, you know all about this here, so so it's rice harvesting season, right? Yeah. Okay, so they're drying the rice out here. Now, how long does it take to dry this rice? If the whole day they have a sun, it's one day. Just one day? Yeah. Is enough to dry the one rice day out? Two days. Okay. So uh, this is you now this is raw rice right out of the field. They harvest it, yeah, and they put then it out if here. If the dry is one, if you want to uh, make a rice, you go to the rice mill. Okay, so after it's dry, they take it over to the rice mill. Now, if you if you want if they wanted to sell it just as it is, then it's thirty pesos a kilo, something like that, right? Okay. And then how much does it cost to mill it, do you know? I don't know how much. Okay, so you pay the mill, you mill it, and there you go. Now rice that's you buy from the store, white rice, is about fifty-eight pesos a no, kilo. It's expensive today, this year, yeah. Um, 68, 69 is before you can buy a rice, uh, 38 kilo, 32, they have a kilo bit before, but now so expensive rice. Rice is expensive. Today. <laughs> the hand of Marcos. Okay. So Alright. Well, anyways, I just, I just wanted to show this one uh, street here on the highway because uh, you got you got it up. A lot of rice along this road here, so it looks like they have a, a bumper crop of rice here. A video of you. Is that your rice out there? Some of that rice? Yeah. Is it good? Uh, good crop this year of rice. Right yeah. now. Oh yeah. I see you got a lot of rice. So you dr you dry it one day today, just one day out there, and it's done. Okay. And then what are you gonna do? You gonna bring it to the mill? Bring it to the mill. Now, how much? We don't know. How much does it cost for the mill? Do you know? How much does it cost to mill it? How many kilos you got out there? Kilos. You got a lot of kilos? Mm. Oh, yeah? <laughs> it's a good year for rice, huh? Okay. All right. Okay, we've got some serious sacks of rice here. <laughs> you brought the dog. Okay, we've arrived at the rice mill. Alright, the one that gave us trouble before is still untied. Rice, do you got here? Eighty eighty seven kilos. Two and a half pesos per kilo. All right, so there's the grand milling machine. Two hundred fifty pesos. All right.
Dunk, He's right? Scared. Are you scared of the rice meal? What are you, what are you scared yeah, of, Dunk? Yeah, I need to put the rice meal in here. No, 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 no. Poor Dunk, right? All right, there's, there's the business end of the whole thing here. Let's go. Let's go introduce your dog to everyone over here. I mean, what's your dog's name? Vigo. Vigo, right? Yeah. Okay. It's my legal. <laughs> Alright, now this dog, this dog was actually used as a stud dog, believe it or not. <laughs> yeah, this is a boy. Yeah. Yeah, two years. Yes, this is a little, it's only, two years. That dog's only two years old? Yeah. I don't know, it kind of lost all of his hair, but it's, it's growing back. Uh, it's scared with you. Scared of me. <laughs> Come here. Leave me all day. Bye. Bye-bye! Oh, she's scared me if I go away. <laughs> There's the princess in Indai. <laughs> 60. Six pieces of ice candy? Yeah, 10 pesos per one. We're going to find out what ice candy is Yeah, here. 10 pesos per one. <laughs> find out uh, bingo, Dai? Oh, mango? that stuff? Oh, yes, mango. Mango ice candy. Do I get one? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Uh, Let's see what Dunkway thinks of his mango ice candy. <laughs> This is only 10 pesos? With Tlico, right? Yeah, so it was only 10 pesos. So yeah, it's, this is really good. Uh, mango flavored, uh, I don't know, little popsicle thing. All right, so, you have to go far to find a rice field here. This is the dry season. So I guess the way it works is, uh, they plant it when it's wet out there, and we're at the end of March here, and so everything is dried out. They bring it in, and mill it then, dry it and mill it. Okay, it's all in the hopper now. 
big bag is ready. 12.17. Uh, I think that's about uh, nine minutes. Rice in here? We gotta yeah, yeah. weigh the, 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 that's the husk. Like the polar, like a... That's the that's the skin? Yeah. Okay. So your dad your dad's gonna use the skin for something. Yes. Okay. Alright. Well we'll figure out all the weights and the costs. How long it took, all that. We'll give a final report on this deal here. Alright everybody, pile in. Woohoo! Okay, we made it back to the top of the hill here with the rice. It's never been clear to me how much me and Jovi are going to keep out of this, but they can have what they want. <laughs> That's a rot of rice. <laughs> and that's like one one fourth of it of what they got here that we did today. They got all that still. Yeah. So it's better not to mill it though until you're kind of ready for it though. Yeah, to eat it, right? You need to wait it if you finish this one. It won't keep forever. Hey Mike, there's a bucket of rice out in the back of the truck. Can you go out there and get it for me? Alright. Princess, Indai, can you guys help me bring this bucket inside? Mike, you want to try the new rice? Okay. Man, it doesn't really taste like anything. Well, Mike, that's the idea. The rice takes on the flavor of whatever you have with it. Hey, Princess, can you go get Mike something for his rice? <laughs> Water, really? <laughs> Thanks, Princess. <laughs> <laughs>